And now, your Precision 18 forecast. News 18. Weather from where you live. Wind chill advisory in effect for the entire viewing area, much of the Midwest. This light purple on your screen right here, including all of Tippecanoe County and the greater Lafayette region, under that wind chill advisory through 11 a.m. Eastern Time tomorrow morning. And here's why. The bitterly cold conditions continue to push southward across the region. Negative 10 right now with wind chill. Fort Wayne, it is feeling like 14 below zero in Madison, Wisconsin. Davenport, Iowa, negative 13, negative 14 in Chicago. Here at home, not much better. In fact, we feel like negative 7 right now in West Lafayette. It feels like 13 below in Remington. Feels like negative 12 currently in Rochester. Even our southern counties feeling that chill at negative 6 with an actual air temperature in Crawfordsville of 12. It's 9 degrees in Lafayette right now. Seeing the single digits across the far northern portions of the region and we're expected to get even colder before the night is up. Your Renaissance camera this evening, crystal clear skies and cold. That's the story out there. 9 degrees in Lafayette. Winds are sustained from the west-northwest 14 miles per hour. As higher pressure inches its way ever closer from the Great Plains, it's a little bit closer to the low pressure system off to our northeast. And the closer to those two pressure systems get together, the stronger those winds get. So that's why we're seeing wind gusts up around 20, 25 miles per hour. We even clocked one wind gust here in Lafayette at 31 miles per hour earlier on this evening. So dangerously cold conditions overnight tonight. Not only are we expected to see temperatures fall back down towards that zero degree mark, but we're also expecting those wind chills fall as low as negative 20, possibly even lower at times overnight tonight into early tomorrow morning. Single digit temperatures are expected for your Thursday as high temperatures. In fact, tomorrow's high will match the coldest day in Lafayette since January. And on top of that, I could be talking about some chances of snow later on this weekend. Dry conditions at least for the time being as that system continues to roll further off to these few light flurries earlier on. Higher pressure building in from the west, generating that northwesterly wind flow that will continue to keep those wind chills well below the zero mark overnight tonight into early tomorrow morning. Your current temperature, or I should say your overnight low temperatures tonight as low as zero. Winnemac, four degrees in Romney. Three will be your overnight low temperature in West Lafayette, matching last night's overnight low. High pressure continues to kick eastward, keeping the skies clear tomorrow. Notice a northwesterly wind flow across the region, but as this high pushes off to the east, it's going to allow temperatures to be slightly warmer late tomorrow night into early Friday morning. Highs tomorrow, however, only reaching 9 degrees for tomorrow afternoon. We only fall off to 5, only 5, right? But chances of snowfall move in late Friday evening with a passing warm front. That's going to help drive temperatures back up to around 30 degrees on Friday. Saturday, 46. Unfortunately, by Sunday night, Monday morning, we'll be back down to negative two. I can't keep up. A roller coaster continues, and it's going to be brutal over the next few days. Exactly. I mean, that cold just pierces you. Oh, right now, and it's going to get only worse so during the overnight hours here. All right. We'll yeah. keep an eye on that. Yeah. Thanks, Kim.